virus, we have um, gone away from cues and, and printed the thing, so there should be a printed. insert there hey. called infant baptism insert that you'll find in the papers this morning, and that's where we'll turn to. And we are so pleased and delighted to have the Detmers here and to have Leora come and join us and have her name written in the Book of Life. Such a great thing. God, who is rich in mercy and love, gives us a new birth into a living hope through the baptism, sacrament of baptism, by water and the word of God, delivers us from sin and death and raises us to new life in Jesus Christ. We are united with all the baptized in the one body of Christ, anointed with the gift of the Holy Spirit, and joined in God's mission for the life of the world. So I would have um, Leora's sponsors and parents uh, say the following words that we present Leora Grace Detmer for baptism. I present Leora Grace Detmer for baptism. Called by the Holy Spirit, trusting in the grace and love of God. As you bring Leora to receive the gift of baptism, you're entrusted with responsibilities to live with Leora among God's faithful people, to bring Leora the Word of God and the Holy Supper, teach Leora the Lord's Prayer, the Creed, and the Ten Commandments, place in Leora's hands the Holy Scriptures, and nurture Leora in faith and prayer, so that Leora may learn to trust God, proclaim Christ through word and deed, care for others, and the Word of God, work God made, and work for justice and peace. So Luke and Amanda, do you promise to help Leora grow in the Christian faith and life? I do. I do. Sponsors, do you promise to nurture Leora in the Christian faith as you are empowered by God's Spirit and to help her live in the covenant of baptism and in communion with the church? I do. People of God, do you promise to support Leora and pray for her in her new life in Christ? We do. We do. Please stand. I ask you to profess your faith in Christ Jesus, reject sin, and confess the faith of the church. Do you renounce the devil and all the forces that defy God? Do you renounce the powers of this world that rebel against God? Do you renounce the ways of sin that draw you from God? I renounce them. Do you believe in God the Father? I believe in God the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. Do you believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of God? I believe in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day he rose again. He ascended into heaven. He is seated at the right hand of the Father, and he will come again to judge the living and the dead. Do you believe in God, the Holy Spirit? I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. And Barbara, I'll have you pour the baptismal water into the pot, and we pour the water as a, a sign that this is living water of baptism, living running water that we use to symbolize what's being done for Leora this morning. And I invite Luke and Amanda and sponsors and uh, to bring Leora forward.
by the baptism of Jesus' death and resurrection, you set us free from the power of sin and death, and raise us up to live in you. Pour out your Holy Spirit, the power of your living word, that those who are washed in the waters of baptism may be given you. To you be given honor and praise through Jesus Christ, our Lord, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, now and forever. Amen. And I would have you hold we are to spend over the baptismal front. Thank you. We are a grace stepper. I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Let us pray. We give you thanks, O God, and through water and the Holy Spirit, we give your daughters and sons new birth, cleanse them from sin, and raise them to eternal life. Sustain the oral with the gift of your Holy Spirit, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and might, the spirit of knowledge and joy in your presence, both now and forever. Amen. Amen. I'll have you take your baptismal candle and light it from the Christ candle. We'd suggest on the anniversary of this day that you get the candle out and light it that we are to come to know the importance of what's been done for her. Jesus said, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will have the light of life. Let us welcome the newly baptized. We welcome you into the body of Christ and in his mission we share. Join us in giving thanks and praise to God and bearing God's created and redeeming word to all the world. Luke, I'm going to have you come with me. I don't carry the babies right now, but... We'll show her off, our new sister in Christ. Oh, girl. Hey, I thought you are doing such a good job. Honey. Thank you so much, Pastor Jeff. Wipe right out. Here, Grandma get you. Amanda? Can I get you here some form, some paperwork? Thank you. Oh, Wonderful. Good. Thank you so much. Can you watch out for your show? Yeah, that's okay. You're good, right? Yeah, you're good. You're good. Okay. Should we just uh, get pics now? <laughs> like in front of the. Okay. Okay. I'll get one just of that plaque and then I'll get one. That'd be great. Okay. Here, though. Okay. All right.